We have been entertained by Patrick Warburton ever since he played Elaine's boyfriend on Seinfeld. Now he's getting rave reviews on the CBS comedy Rules of Engagement. What are you doing? My scotch is out there. <laughs> Look! Yeah, I know, I see it. Single malt right there in the bar. <laughs> Patrick Warburton, good morning. Good morning. Is it hard to see yourself doing your work? Always. No. <laughs> I never know with actors. Sometimes you go, like, you think, oh, I could have done that better. Or if you watch and go, yeah, that was a pretty good take. Yeah, <laughs> there's always a little bit of that. But, uh, no, nah, we're having a lot of fun doing the show. It's a blast. It's so much fun watching you on the show. Mm. How would you describe Jeff, Jeff Bingham as a man and as a husband? Uh, I... A guy who's, uh, I guess, certainly got a, a lot of uh, ad, uh, attitude and is uh, pretty outspoken about it. I don't know. I mean, I, Jeff's, Jeff's just kind of like me, minus the four kids, I guess. In real life, you've been married 18 years. 18 but years, yeah. on the show, you've been married about 13, 14 years 13, or 14, so. 13, 14, yeah. Is there anything that you learn about marriage from your character? No. or do you? <laughs> no. <laughs> Nothing? Nothing. Do you try and teach her character anything no. after 18 years? No. What are the lessons to be learned about I, marriage? I, I, I hope they're really, you know, the half hour show, really, the four camera show should just be absurd and fun and silly. And I think that's what this is. And, um, uh, the, you know, you, you, can, you can relate. I can relate. Uh, but uh, we leave it all up to the writers primarily and uh, just, you know, follow our wife. The, the writing is so funny. It's so good. We have good writers on the show. And I got to love David Spade. I'm a huge fan of his. What is it like working with him? It's great, you know. You know, it's great working with David. He has a new girlfriend, uh, you know. I'm not going to, uh, you know, for the, to respect their privacy, I won't mention her name. I will tell you that she did just deliver eight babies. <laughs> okay, you know now that, that that's out of the bag. and is That could never happen. She's like in her 20s. Oh, She's okay. way too old. <laughs> Um, Megan uh, did not have a breast augmentation. She had a baby last year. There's a lot of speculation because they were enormous, you know. But I think they're back to regular large size now. <laughs> Are There's... you going to get in trouble with David or <laughs> when you get... Or Megan or anybody else on the show? Yeah, or Megan, exactly. I think it's all good. I, they're not up this early. Dave, oh, it's we'll, not we'll get them early. a copy. Don't worry. Oh, please do or, that. Or YouTube. You know, see, okay. that's the thing with morning uh, television right. now. You got to really be careful what you say. Mm. All right, mm. let's talk a little bit about Putty. How often do you get recognized for? You know, you did nine episodes as Putty, and unforgettable, so hilarious. When you get stopped on the street, is it more from Jeff on Rules of Engagement or Putty from Seinfeld or anything else you've done? It's uh, it's both. It's a uh, seems to be uh, equally both now, pretty much. Or even The Tick, which is a short-lived series I did that uh, people still, still seem to be fascinated by. Die-hard fans. Yeah. All right, before yeah. we go, because they're giving me a wrap, can you do a high five for me? High five. High five. There you All go. Right, thanks, buddy. Speak down here from your diaphragm. Okay. High five. High five. High five. There you go. That was good. Patrick Warburton, thank you.